If you'd like the parrying dagger, you can head to the Murkwater Cave, and this is an Limgrave. And then once you're at this cave, it's pretty easy to find it. You just head up from the Murkwater Coast here and just head down, or you can come from the bottom part of the river and just head up. But once you're inside, you need to locate patches and make him become a vendor, and then you'll be able to buy the parrying dagger from him. Go ahead and try to open up this chest. And that will spawn patches in. He should surrender. Almost killed him. Very close to killing him. Alright. And he'll surrender and then eventually become a merchant for you. Say forgive and forget. So don't be I'll be ready to <laughs> no, I'll be ready to And now you need to reload the area and come back. I'm just gonna quit and exit and then restart. If you've been to the volcano manor, he will be up at the volcano manor instead. If you haven't been there, he'll still be here. And as you can see, he is not here for me because I've already been to the Volcano Manor. So I'm going to make my way up to the Volcano Manor. If you take that chest right there, it'll trap you and take you to the Mist Woods. And then you won't be able to fast travel. So I'm just going to go back to the entrance and then fast travel up to the Mount Gelmer's place. Volcano Manor. And then just back here in the entrance of the Volcano Manor will be Patches set up shop right here. And now he will sell you stuff and you can buy the parrying dagger from Patches as well as some other nice things like Margaret Shackle.